Convergence leveled up to YouTube. Or maybe YouTube leveled up to Convergence. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Joseph Scrimshaw! <laughs> I, too, would like to influence the judges with my wardrobe choice. <laughs> I'm, I'm there. <laughs> they were in the <laughs> I will get a five for incredibility. <laughs> It didn't make sense, though, is our question. <laughs> what was that thing? <laughs> Let us begin. Tomorrow is yesterday's today times two. Of course we all know what that means. We're talking about how to service the customer. <laughs> <laughs> we need to ask ourselves, what does the customer want? The customer wants social media. We all know social media is extremely important, but what is social media? Let's all ask that question out loud. What is social media? It's beating something that is dead. <laughs> don't know what it is that they want. This graph represents what the customers want. They want to live in a world where they can win. So you know what we have to do? We need to lie to the customer about the world. Let's all say that together. Let's lie to the customer about the world. Next slide. <laughs> thinks they don't want something. <laughs> and it is our job to give it to them anyway. <laughs> and teach them to like it. <laughs> How will we do this? Through social media. <laughs> There will be elaborate monkey-beating-dead-things Bill Corbett, Kevin Murphy porn. Let's all say that together. There will be elaborate monkey-beating-dead-things Bill Corbett, Kevin Murphy porn. I thank you and the customer thanks you. Next slide. <laughs> Sometimes you have to innovate for the customer. The customer might like one part of our product, but not the other. They like the way Axe smells. They like what it does for their sexual lifestyles. They don't like the way it's applied. <laughs> teddy bear who spell, smells like manly, manly, sexy time. They want to be able to just walk up to the Ewok, lower their armpit upon it, and rub their armpits on its head. They want to rub their armpits on an Ewok's head. Let's all say that together. They want to rub their armpits on the Ewok's head. Next slide. <laughs> I think that's clear. Next slide. <laughs> Sometimes you have to accept, as much as we try to make the customer one person, we try to perceive the customer as a whole one living being, we have to accept that some customers are different. For example, some customers are 40-year-old men, and some customers are 20-year-old women. <laughs> And they like different things. So we give them different doctors. Let's all say that together. We give them different doctors. 
Now, ladies, why don't you just take a second to look at David Tennant crying in the rain. <laughs> if you feel the need to remove clothing, there are no customers here that's acceptable to do at this time. <laughs> David Tennant's work here is done. Next slide. <laughs> this is what happens when we tell the customer they cannot have cheeseburger. <laughs> they will eat whatever they can get. So we must always have cheeseburger for the customer. Let's say that together. We must always have cheeseburger for the customer. Next slide. <laughs> when we give the customer the cheeseburger, we get to be smug bastards. <laughs> How are we smug bastards? We hold cute things in our hands. <laughs> The cute things are, of course, a lie. They are an analogy for money. <laughs> cute things are money. Let's say that together. Cute, cute things are money. money. Next slide. <laughs> the X and Y are, of course, speaking about chromosomes. <laughs> We need to, again, appeal to everyone by showing them various phallic objects at all times. Sometimes we run out of phallic objects to show our customer, so we need to make them associate a phallus with something that is not a phallus. For example, putting a lightsaber, a whip, in Daniel Craig's abs next to a fez. The next time you see a fez, you are going to think penis. <laughs> Let's all say that together. The next time you see a fez, you are going to think penis. Next slide. <laughs> the next time you see a fez, you are going to think penis. You guys are so ahead of the game. Next slide. <laughs> Sometimes the customer gets crabs. <laughs> Let's all say that together. Sometimes the customer gets crabs. Whose problem is that? You guys are on top of this. Next slide. We all know that this is what happened to me last night. We must never let the customer know what actually happened last night. Let's all say that together. We must never let the customer know what actually happened last night. Next slide. All right, David, look at that. Joseph, Joseph, Joseph. Oh, Joseph, Joseph, Joseph. Joseph. Oh, Rosa, Rosa, Rosa. 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 Ros
Yes, it yes, did work for you, Kevin. Howdy, head of the mind too. Uh, <laughs> shutting you up. Anyway, very, very well.